the theme of the 13th Dakart Biennale is a new humanity. The work on show by 75 artists from 33 countries raises questions of identity and immigration. But at its heart, Dakart is, and has always been, about illuminating what has always existed. About recognizing the huge diversity of art created by Africans from the continent and the diaspora. Well, I think uh, it's absolutely fundamental that uh, biennales like this exist in different parts of the world. So I think there is a need for to have more, even more of those. I wish there was more opportunities from people from different parts of the world to actually show their work and actually meet some of the influential people of the art world. According to Art Basel's 2017 art market analysis, South America and Africa accounted for 4% of the international market share. But those figures don't tell the whole story. African art has sold for record levels at auction. And just taking one look at the crowds here confirm the vibrancy of art, not just from Senegal, but across the continent. This edition showcases different textiles that have become emblematic of contemporary African art. The printed cloth in Nigerian artist Olan Rewaju Tajuso's wall pieces. The sheer materiality of Ndidi Dike's sculptures. This work um, is inspired by the resource extraction industry, partic with particular emphasis on uh, the Congo. And um, I think uh, the use of latex has a lot of tactility, and if you look at the work, you, you get a sense of mapping and cartography and for me that was a very important aspect in terms of um, talking about the different aspects of the Congo. But the Biennale is also cognizant of the fact that with so few homegrown resources allocated to art in Africa, many artists end up abroad. Well, there are a lot of artists, African artists who live in, in Europe or in different countries out of Africa and at the same time, you know, that's our origin where we come from. But at the same time, also, uh, it, it, it borders the border of Africa. You know, it's not something fixed only on Africa, being an African, I think. And also, it gives us a lot of chance, uh, visibility, because uh, as a diaspora, it's not that much sometimes easy uh, to have those kind of uh, visibility. Dakar runs for a month, and this year in particular, there's a sense that the continent is starting to receive the attention it deserves, and that the rest of the world is poised, finally, to see what African artists do next. Miranda Atti, TRT World, Dakar, Senegal. <laughs>